in the world is Superwoman today, eh? Mumbai, India. What up everyone, it's your girl, Superwoman. And every once in a while I get a tweet from you lovelies being like, today my teacher showed your video in class. And that always makes me feel super thrilled and honored, but also like super confused because what the F was that lesson about? Hello class and welcome to Career Counseling 101. Now today, we're gonna evaluate all of your career options. For those of you pursuing a career in psychology, your career options are YouTuber, Viner. Any questions? I'm totally kidding. Real talk though, don't stress. If you are getting a degree in psychology, you can totally use your degree to become a sales associate. And that got me thinking, what if YouTubers were teachers? I mean like, what if we taught school classes and you, our viewers, were our students? I mean, we're already really good at Q&As. So let's make like Columbus and explore the situation. First of all, our class attendance would be awesome because think about it, if we can get people to watch our videos, we can definitely get people to attend our class. Welcome to Oh my god, there's a snake inside me! This is gonna be so awesome. And in this class, you're gonna learn all about biology. Wait, biology? I thought we were gonna see a snake inside of you. Yes, correct. There is a snake inside of me. It's called my intestine, so technically I didn't lie. And I'm gonna teach you all about it. Wait, where's the snake? I want to see the snake. That's what the class description said. You won't believe your eyes. You said there was a huge snake! Yes, there's a large intestine and a small intestine. Oh, why did I take this class? Hey, at what time does she actually show the snake? Clickbait for days. Welcome to how to make her your queen. Chess club. Welcome to you won't believe what's inside her booty. Anatomy. Welcome to one direction chaos. History. Although, I guess that one's accurate now. Don't shoot, don't shoot, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And I'm pretty sure YouTubers would have a really unique way of teaching things. Diagrams? <laughs> note taking? Nah. Group projects? F a group project. Hey, what? I hate group projects, why? So Tim can do no work and Tim can get an A? F you, Tim. Tim, F you. I might have been Tim. This is how YouTubers would teach things. OMG, I have never been this early in a class. Good morning class, it's your teacher Miss Singh and I'm so excited because today, look who it is! It's me, Mr. Sanders from Next Door's history class. And if you don't know who Mr. Sanders is, what are you doing? You've oh. gotta check out his history class. I'm gonna put his room number on the board. Oh, thank you! Oh, oh so good I'm to so see you. you made it. Yeah, it's, it's an fun. honor. I know, it's right? So, so overdue. Long. I know. Uh, who is that? Oh, faves. First. I totally ship it. Today we're going to teach you about sex education with the, the condom, condom challenge. challenge. What I'm going to do is fill up a condom with water and then drop it on Mr. Sanders' head to show you exactly how strong a condom really is. I'm so nervous. I have no idea what's going to happen. Are you ready, Mr. Sanders? I'm ready. Let's do it. Mm. <laughs> That's right. I want everyone to stop and tag someone that you might think to hook up with. Um, miss, I thought condoms went on the other head. Leave a comment, Katie. All the staff member collabs. And there's a challenge for every subject. World studies, accent challenge, visual arts, pancake art challenge, chemistry, diet coke and mentos challenge, drama class, cinnamon challenge, or let's be real, any other challenge where people eat food, even if it's completely normal. But if there isn't a challenge for a certain class, why are you tripping? We have other ways. All right, class, today we're gonna do a fun experiment. I need everyone to walk out into the hallway and pretend you're having a heart attack. What kind of experiment is this? A social experiment. And for a final mark, you're all gonna have to complete a project. What kind of project? What does it do? What does this involve? Can't tell you that. It's a secret project. And to be honest, YouTubers would be really good teachers. I mean, we're really good at creating safe spaces where everyone feels welcome and comfortable. Well, most of the time. All right, class, I finished marking your tests and I'm gonna be honest, I was pretty disappointed. I'm not gonna mention any names or make a scene because I don't want anyone to feel uncomfortable. But I'm about to hand back these tests right now and somebody failed, I'm not gonna say who, but somebody here failed. It was Gabby, Gabby, it was you, you failed. Look at this test, this is your app, how do you feel? Her parents are gonna kill her. I'll call them. Oh, you think her parents are gonna kill her? Look at this app. Look at her. 
All right, everybody open up to page three. YouTubers would give their students the best books to read because we know what's cool and we know what students like to read and what's educational, okay? But we also know how broke some teachers could be. All right, class, for homework, I'm gonna need you to read chapters one through five of our new class novel. But I mean, if you don't have time to read those chapters, I get it. Wait, what? No, like I understand. Sometimes you don't have the time in a day to hold a book, open the book, read the book. Who has time for that, right? Is she serious? Yeah, so you know what you should do instead? You should listen to the book. And I know you're thinking, Miss, how do we do that? Well, don't worry, I got you. You should visit audible.com that has all the latest audiobooks. In fact, oh I'll even- Oh my God, stop it already. Yeah, we'd be the best teachers ever. Yo, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, you know what to do. Give it a big thumbs up, especially because I'm sick and dying and I made the video anyways and I sound like a stupid person in it because of my voice and I did it anyways. So I think you should click the thumbs up if, if you want, only if you want. You don't have to, I guess. Subscribe and let me know what your favorite part of the video was. If you want to check my last video, it is right there. It's called Things People Say to Vegetarians. My vlogs are right over there and I'm in India, so they're pretty cool. Check them out. You can also subscribe because I make new videos every Monday. And there's the also exciting news. Uh, our first feature film, A Trip to Unicorn Island, is now available in so many more countries. All the countries are in the description, so if you haven't seen it yet, now's the time. The time is now. Go check it out. All the links are in the description. One love, Soup Woman. That is a wrap. And Zoop! <coughs> Ooh. JK! Oh, man. Oh. Ooh. Are you good, Thomas? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna say one more line. Okay. <laughs> I got a condom collar. <laughs>